sideways on the screen again. Are we sideways on the screen? I bet we are, didn't we? You joined us live, late live. Sorry yeah, we've been late. Sorry. It's it's a bit flaky, isn't it? Yeah. Little. Is it? Um, can you hear us okay? And is this? If we sideways on your screens at home, do I have to turn the phone around? Anyway, this is the morning after the night before. It's not too bad here, really. No, it's not too bad. It is windy. Exactly. Yeah. Sideways. You are okay. sideways. Okay. Right, there we go. <laughs> yeah, we had about 60 knots last night. Uh, didn't have much sleep, as you can imagine, yeah. with the gusts. Uh, this guy anchored we set out in the river last night drifting around in the all night getting yeah. closer and closer to our boat yeah shouldn't be there really yeah. should be like the dock and uh no no trees down here but they've been having it really bad last night and this morning stay up in cape breton and yeah, further really north bad. of halifax and it's been really really bad really bad yeah. yeah so hopefully you can hear us okay <laughs> Yeah, yeah, we had about 60 knots or 50, 60 knots. Um, it's been okay, really, because uh, it's been next, tied next to Bruce's schooner, weighs 18 ton. It just kept us steady all night, uh, got up loads and stuff, and it's been okay, isn't it? Yeah. And we've just been speaking to the guy here at uh, Bridge, Bridgewater Marina, and he says we're going to have hot showers in there, the heating's on, if there's a dryer in there, so we can go in there. Free of charge, so thank you very much. Do you want a little look in there? Yeah. <laughs> it is still quite windy. How do you work that? I've got to put it on there. 1965. I need to talk. Just gonna try and get into. <laughs> It's absolutely freezing here. It's about it below. But it's not, it's only about 13 degrees, but it's the wind, you probably can't hear me. We probably go back to the boat now anyway. Well, I don't think you can actually get in there. Damn it, it's hot showers and uh, laundry. No, any luck? No. <laughs> Let's go back to the boat. If you want it too windy. Oh. Sorry about all the wind noise. If we go back to the boat now, uh, it's not too bad here, really, is it? It's been very wet and cold. Oh, 13, 12 to 13 hours. It's just stopped this morning. Yeah. I'm sure it's the boat. Cold. There's a schooner here. There's our boat anchored out there. Then there's Bruce's schooner with Atlas. Hello to everyone. Yeah, hope everybody's doing okay. Yeah. Oh, it's back in the warm mouth. <laughs> nice. <laughs> uh, 
We're just reading the comments now on the yeah. laptop. The eye is passed. It has passed. Hello to everyone. Hello, Cara Gibson. Ken. Yeah. Tim. Uh, hello, Joe. I think everybody. we're going to be um, debating whether to go back down to La Hague Yacht Club this evening or tomorrow morning. Yeah, I'm not sure because we've got 1800 this evening. They are. They're forecasting 38 knot gusts, and then by 9 o'clock it's 22 knot gusts. So we could potentially go down there this evening and then just grab a mooring. But we are all good. It's been a, wow, yeah, uncomfortable night. It hasn't been that uncomfortable, no, has it? I, I was waking up, well, it felt like every half hour I was waking up looking out the window to see where that anchor boat was. Because the wind's maybe coming more from north to more westerly and it's going to blow him onto us. Uh, hopefully it won't be too bad tonight. Hi, Kathy Bruce. Everything you say is echoed two seconds later. <laughs> oh, it's not, is it? We need to restart live, yeah. Uh, should we restart it then? Batten down the hatches. Yeah. Just stay until tomorrow, no hard. Yeah, yeah this, it's quite nice here because there's a few shops yeah. Supermarket, so we can go there and get some food. Yeah, and hopefully, we can get into that shower block. Oh, I know to have a hot shower and dry some clothes. It'd be amazing! Yeah. So nice. There is someone on the anchored boat. Um, that was my to be honest, through the nights, um, my main concern was this boat because if the wind comes from this direction a little bit then it's getting right on top of us but he's getting really close there's somebody on there uh, they've had the lights on all night so they've been up all night and they got their engine running it's a very nice vessel but it's just been a bit concerning because they've been so close Transmission is going out to the web via two masts on Nova Scotia. Yeah. No, two signals. Yeah, it's uh, one of our, well, our friend Jeff Tinley who lives just down the road. His power's out. Apparently, 80% of Nova Scotia has lost their power. Yeah, they have. But the internet still works. Internet masts. This is crazy. Uh, it, wasn't, it wasn't too bad last night. It just It's basically like having uh, a gale or a severe, severe gale back in the UK. Um, but yeah. I think where the eye passed over, what was it, Cape Breton? Yeah. And um, Canso got the worst of it. Still really bad up there now, like 100, 100 knots or something, wasn't it? Yeah, 100 knots. <sighs> just hope no one got injured. Mm, yes. People are asking to turn the camera to landscape. Yeah, I know, I tried it, but I can't get it to work. <laughs> Sunny here in Farmer, Cornwall. Sense of water in the air. Take care, guys. Thanks. Yeah, it is unfortunately. Mm. That's disconnected. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so. Oh, I'm gonna have some lunch for yeah. a bit. Warm up. I'm looking forward to going up there and having a hot shower. If you can get into the door. You can get in. That guy got in, didn't he? Yeah. Condensation dripping off the oh, skylight all the time. Yeah. A bit nasty. Mm. But it's going to be warmer next week, isn't it? Yes, it's going to be 18, 19 degrees next week. Yeah. So we did survive the hurricane. <laughs> you do look tired. I am. Oh, David S. Wheatley. It's our weather guy. Difficult to follow. I did keep disappearing on the screen. What you're saying? What's for lunch? Mm. Bad echo. Probably the internet. What is for lunch today? Probably a pasta, some sort cheese of pasta. Cheese on toast. Oh, cheese on toast. We've got yeah. bread and we and cheese. Yeah. Cheese and beans on toast. Cheese and beans on <laughs> toast. Uh, Yeah, we did make the, make the right decision to move up the river. I think it would have been pretty 
bouncy and rough to stay on that moor and down in the Hague Yacht Club. There's a lot of what they call fetch. You know, the uh, the wind and the waves can build up and build up and it would have been really bad on the mooring. People are saying there is echo. And uh, other people are saying there is no echo. I don't know, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've got this working now, so we can do it. Um, somebody says... Drew says, thanks, you've helped convince my wife, my Welsh wife, Jeanette, 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 go sailing. go sailing, nice, yes, you made the right decision, we river, yeah, stay safe guys, Mark, thanks, Mark, uh, Andrew, was it better without the master, yes, it was a lot better, yeah, it was so much more, well, less, less windage, windage. and we're just like, it, with the master, you get pulled side to side like that, and the boat is like healing over a little bit, but we got none of that, the wind is just, Screaming over the top of the hull, it's lovely. Uh, Uncle Phil says pork chops and mixed vegetables for dinner here in France. That disappeared. Oh, sounds uh, delicious. Enjoy. <laughs> haven't found another dinghy sailing site but yet, all looking good. Mm. Hello from Pool Harbour, hello. Your new cooker. We follow you guys since episode four, the Round Britain trip. What do you expect? When do you expect to be back in the Caribbean? Think of the lovely warm seas, lot, lot safe no. chaps. Yeah, we expect to be back in the Caribbean early November, I think, or late October. Yeah. Hope to just get, get that weather window to get down south. Yeah, that get is the main thing. Back in the warm temperatures. I'm sure my blood's gone thin. Being in the cold more now, I'm not used to it. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody says, so you got a new cooker and all you can think of is cheese on toast. Come on, Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> Sailing Brothers Cookbook. It'll just be cheese-related recipes, isn't it? <laughs> yes, and just cheese. Cheese on toast. And mashed potato and gravy and uh, meat and sauces. That's it. Oh, and egg omelette spilled on the floor. <laughs> oh, Dag. Hey, Dag. No right. echo, but still not landscape picture on the screen. Yeah. You can't get, la I don't know, it's not working. We got landscape. it. For the previous slides, I managed to sort it out, so I can't sort it out here, so it's uh, tough. We'll have to just deal with that. <laughs> thin for now, unfortunately. Yeah. Uh, we will sort it, try and sort it out. I don't know how we did it last time. I can't remember how we done it. I don't know. Ronnie Patterson, Hubby and Newson went to Southampton Boat Show last weekend. They've now bought another boat, second hand, not new. Oh, it's so exciting getting another boat yeah, in there, a new is. boat. Yeah. Uh, somebody, oh, Kara says, uh, love your new cook. I know, yeah. it's so nice. You put the flame on and the flame is blue rather than being like orange and Next horrible. The pans, oh. bottom of the pans go all yeah. sticky and black. Normally our pans are go black. The kettle's black, the bottom of that now. See, this is this is what would happen with our pans before. I know this is not good, and you can like die from this sort of stuff. But it makes it go all sooty, like that. But now it's just like a nice blue flame. It's lovely. And yeah, we did have some hurricane chips last night. <laughs> we I'm did. A, I had my blanket out, and uh, eating crisps last night. Hurricane chips. Somebody says, are you stopping in North Carolina on your way down? No, we're not. No, we can't go back into the USA because we've used our visa. We're not allowed to be banned. Allowed. No, we haven't. <laughs> no, it's not allowed back in there. Yeah, we just used our visa and you can't. With the USA, they're really strict. You can't pop to Canada because it's a neighbourhood, neighbour, neighbouring country. And then pop back to the USA. You've got to go totally out of the area like the South America or back over to Europe and stay over there for a good amount of time, then you're allowed back in. It's really weird how it's done. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> we're not frozen, we're just no, reading we're just that. reading the coins, uh, trying to read it at the same time. I only have an induction hob. Yeah. Induction hob, what's that, electric? Yeah, I think that's electric. We have we enough sure. electric on board for that. <laughs> And it, all I, I think about is cheese on toast. I know. Cheese and beans on toast. Mm. What happens the visa-wise after the Panama Canal? 
re-landing in the USA. Yeah, we don't know if we're going back up, up the east coast, up the west coast, do we, into the USA? We're not sure. We've got to work all that out, whether we're allowed to go back in there or not, or whether. Yeah, we're... No, we should be okay because we're going down out. and out. Right, back quite out. Yeah. Yeah. We're not sure. If, we're not sure if we're just going to cross the Pacific straight away, or going to go up to Puerto Rico, Mexico, and then some of the countries like that. I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure. Yeah. David S. Wheatley, Florida hurricane, yeah, will blow itself out and disappear, no longer threat to you. We're looking at uh, another hurricane developing on Florida, and you can see it coming up the east coast, and as it gets towards New York, it just diminishes. Yeah. It's no longer there. Hopefully there won't be any more then, so we can plan our escape in Canada. <laughs> you can always stay in Canada, lovely sailing and cheap, we'd adopt you. Ken, but Ken Baker, Baker, Barker, Baker, Baker. I know we love Canada, but oh, it's just too cold, Ken. It's gonna get too cold in uh, a month's time. It'll be freezing cold. Yeah. So just be like, love Canada, though. We really love Canada. Yeah. We really love it, don't we? Yeah. Too cold. Mark Bennett is anchoring clear of other vessels and having a powerful, reliable engine to use when necessarily necessary like your boat you were worried about yeah recognize storm tactic yeah i think it is yeah. i think it is yeah yeah, yeah. love watching youtube so, jackie oh, i hope you recover from covid, COVID. Oh, bloody awful isn't it yeah yeah it's animal <laughs> hopefully you get better soon do you expect headwinds heading south possibly yeah a, a bit of everything really i think so they say in here in Nova Scotia, like October, November, they tend to get northwesterlies as like a predominant wind. Hopefully, we're going to catch a northwesterly down, mm. and then it'll, we'll probably expect all sorts of weather then. Yeah. We'll probably get some headwinds. You might get a low uh, coming off mm. the east coast of America and hitting us. Mm. It's going to be everything until we get down to Bermuda and pick up some trade winds. It's like six days from here down to Bermuda, isn't it? Yeah, it is. And we'll see what happens. Yeah. Somebody said St. Pierre Island near Fa Newfound New Newfoundland. Newfoundland. Newfoundland is actually a French territory, and would it be a thing for our visa Option. issue? Yes, we've heard that before. That. We're not sure whether this. Yeah, that would be absolutely fantastic because we could just pop up to that island, like sign into that French one, and it'd be like. Signing into Europe. Europe and then going into America again. It's a very interesting option. We'll have to look into that. Thank you very much. This means we'll go all the way up there in the freezing cold and try and get back down against oh, the southwesterlies. It'll be an adventure, won't it? <laughs> <laughs> Ken Barker said you get used to the temperatures for nearly 10 years. Oh, I suppose the more you do stuff, the more you get used to it. Yeah. Oh, Cara says she's re watched all our videos again. From the very start, oh, so inspiring. Thanks, super fan. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Can hear okay portrait sideways, so. I know it's a bit. And, uh, uh, we want the the picture going that way because it's good, and then all it says on my device is rotate device. We're not very really good at this. I think we should sh stick to just making the weekly videos. Because we can edit them and make sure they're all nice. But I know when on your screens at home now, we're probably sideways. sideways, but it's in portrait mode. So I don't know. It just says locked and I can't change it. Let's have a look. Oh, no. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, I think we're going to have some cheese on toast now and have a shower. Make use of that. <sighs> Hot shower, warm up a bit. Warm my cockles. Yeah. Do some washing. It'd be nice. Is that it, is it? Yeah. Oh. That's been nearly 20 minutes. 20 yeah. minutes? And the Hurricane Sailing Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> this hasn't been a hurricane down here. No. It's just been cold yeah. and deep low. If we were uh, northeast from here, isn't it? Yeah, north, yeah northeast, northeast. We would be much more trouble because um, it's blowing like over 100 knots up there. Oh. But we've been okay here. Luckily, everybody's been so kind and 
helping us out. So yeah. really appreciate all Canadian people. Yeah. Anyway, I'm looking forward to yeah. hopefully try to be a bit calmer and get some sleep. Yeah. Sleep through the night, um, waking up looking through the window and everything. Have you spotted any interesting wildlife in Canada? Yes. Yeah, we saw a shark going around in a circle. It was sailing past, and the shark was just slowly going around in a circle on its own. Wasn't it? Yeah, shark, porcupine, porcupine, whales, whales. Yeah. You haven't well, seen any bears or no. moose. No. Really shame. No. Yeah. Okay, then that's it then. I'm gonna get some food in my belly and gonna have a shower, I think. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go now because we're gonna eat some chicken on toast. I'm starving and oh. I want a shower. <laughs> Start with the phone horizontal before we start your stream. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we're going back to the uh, yacht club tomorrow. Down in the morning. Yeah, back nice. down there. Crack on with the work we've got to done, do put the mask back up, get yeah. everything ready, look for that weather window to start heading south, I think. Get back down to the warmer temperatures in here. Don't do this. Okay. See you. Yeah, see soon. you everybody. Thanks to everybody that joined and uh, had a chat. It's been yeah. nice talking to you. We'll leave you with shots of the hurricane. Yeah. <laughs>